Thank you for taking the time to look at this video, which shows the operation of our Charpy and Izold hand broaching machine. Our hand machine is designed to be mounted on a customer's own bench, and is designed for cutting Charpy and Izold V and U notches in pre-machined standard 10mm square, subsize and 0.45 inch diameter specimens. We will now explain the setting up and broaching operation of a 10mm square specimen with a 2mm deep V notch. Fitting the brooch. Raise the rack and insert the support pin. Loosen the top clamp retaining screws and withdraw the clamp a small amount. Remove the bottom clamp. Slide the brooch into the groove in the rack and push upwards until the brooch is located in the top clamp. Retaining the upwards pressure on the brooch, refit the bottom clamp and tighten the clamping screws. With the rack in the raised position, insert the pin and tighten the top clamp retaining screws. When setting the axial position, load a 10mm square specimen into the machine and move the adjusting screw so the brooch V is in correct axial position for the standard being produced. Secure the adjusting screw in position by tightening the lock nut. Setting the brooch depth. Raise the rack and insert the support pin. Release the clamping screws so the brass clamping pins are behind the brooch land. Release the stop screw lock nuts and move the stop screws back. Select the correct feeler gauge for the type of brooch being used, as stated in the machine manual. For a C-type brooch, a 5 thou feeler gauge is required. Adjust the stop screws so the feeler gauge is a slide fit between the brooch pilot and the specimen. Ensure the stop screws are evenly adjusted. By eye is OK. Tighten the clamping screw lock nuts. Tighten the rear clamp screws. Check the feeler gauge is a slide fit. Broaching the specimen. Clamp the specimen in position by tightening the rear clamping screws. Apply a coating of cutting oil to the brooch teeth. Remove the support pin holding the handle. Draw the brooch down and cut the notch, rotating the hand wheel at an even rate until all the brooch teeth have passed the test piece. Release the rear clamp screws and remove the notch test piece. Raise the brooch and fit the support pin. Thoroughly clean the brooch of the specimen cuttings using the wire brush supplied and then clean the clamping area ready for the next specimen.